Hello. Today I will show you how to fix a broken Zennheiser HD 429 headphone audio cable. Typical problem when headphones one side or both sides not working or no bass frequencies in music. For less than $5, you will fix your headphones and they will be as good as new. These Sennheiser HD 429 headphones are classics, good headphones at an affordable price. But this time, one side doesn't work. Last time I showed you how to replace a broken 3.5 mm jack on these Sennheiser headphones. This time, let's fix a broken cable at the headphone housing. To repair these headphones, you will need a soldering toolkit, and you must be at least 18 years old, or ask your grandmother for help. Start by cutting off the damaged cable, but make sure there are a few centimeters of wire left. Now you have the option to make a shorter cord, because for these headphones it is 3 meters long and uncomfortable to use. I will cut it in half. Then you need to remove the earpad cushion on the side where the cable input for the headphones is. On this model, the earpad is attached with plastic clips. Carefully pull the earpads out of the clips without bending them. Then unscrew the headphone housing. The screws are hidden under the foam. Be careful that the magnet of the speaker does not pull the screws in, this will damage the speaker. Open the headphones housing and unscrew the board to which the wires are soldered. Here is the wiring diagram. Pull the old cable out of the rubber cable holder. Slide the new cable into the rubber holder. Tie a knot so that the new cable does not slip out of the headphone. Remove the cable outer jacket with a sharp paper knife. Separate the wires by color. Cut off the fabric wires. Then tin the wires so they can be soldered to the board more easily and qualitatively. Then solder the new wires. The sequence is easy. Unsolder one old wire. Solder the new wire of the same color in its place three times until the old wires is removed and the new ones are soldered in place. Pull the extra length of cable out of the headphones. Screw the wire board back in place. Push the cable in a bit and press superglue on it. Pull the cable a bit out so that it glues securely and stays in place without damaging the soldered wires. Then screw the headphone housing in place, but remember, the speaker driver magnet, which can pull the screws into it. Put the ear pad cushion back on. The whole edge of the ear pad should be clipped behind the little plastic hooks. Then connect the headphones to the sound source and do a test listen. You can use the tech screw left and right channel test video, the link is in the description. Everything works, very nice, the headphones looks and works like new. I hope this video was useful for you, my grandfather would be happy if you hit like and subscribe on this video so we can make some more useful headphone repair videos. Good luck.